everybody. Uh, my name is Al Start. Hello, aloha from Go Kid Music. This is our very first and very exciting uh, music tips that I've got prepared for you. So uh, we're going to start on the ukulele. So this is music tips for kids, okay, and for adults who do music with children. Uh, you could be parents or carers or maybe you work in a school and work with young people, uh, maybe you run clubs, that sort of thing. So I'm going to put online loads and loads of my tips. Uh, I've been working with children and doing music with children for years and years and I've got lots of tips and ideas for you. And I'm going to start with something really easy. So it's how to play your first song on the ukulele using one finger. Yay! So. First you have to tune your ukulele because they're always out of tune. Awful! So you can get these little clip-on tuners, they're not very expensive. Uh, if you're in the UK they're about £15 and if you're in America they're probably about $5. Dead cheap. So you just pluck a string and it'll tell you what to do. So top string we want to have G. And you can see the little thingy going up there and when it gets in the middle it's in tune. Then we go down to a C, C, there we go in tune, this should be E, going up to an E, and then A, it's our top note, there we go A, so it's G, C, E, A, so I always say a little rhyme, I say good children eat apples, you remember that, good children, G, good children, C, eat apples a and some people go my dog has fleas my dog has fleas so the first thing you need to do is get your ukulele in tune pause me for a minute um, and come back when your ukulele is in tune like that okay so here we go we're ready to go now when you play the ukulele on a guitar you strum it here, but on a ukulele we strum it here where this bit, which is called the neck, meets the body. So we're going to tuck it in and we're going to have our arm nice and straight. And you just sort of squeeze it into your body here with this arm. Squeeze it into your body a little bit and this hand is going to go underneath it like this. It's just going to hold it underneath the neck here. And then just with one finger like this, or you can do your thumb if you like, um, Try it with the finger, this sort of shape, and you're just going to drag it across the strings loosely. Go like this, as if you're flicking something off. Flick, flicking. So, have a little strum. And you don't have to do it hard, just do it lightly. You can use your wrist and your arm. Okay. Now, um, on the neck, these lines that go across here are called the frets. And what we have to do is press down the string, we have to press this down and hold it down and make sure our finger is behind the line. So this is the first fret, second fret, third fret and we're using these boxes here. Okay. And to make things easier we have give our fingers a number as well. So on the hand, if you're, if you're right handed like me, then this is your left hand that you're playing, going to press down the strings with. And this is finger number one, number two, number three. We sometimes even use cheeky little number four, but not very often. So we're going to use number three today. One, two, three. Because we're going to play a C, which is on our bottom string. So when you hold your ukulele, it's your bottom string. One, two, three. It's the third fret. One, two, three. Can you see that? So I've got my thumb behind like this, and then we're going to strum, and that is C, that's a C major, and that's the easiest chord on ukulele apart from this one, which is A minor 7, technically a chord, there we go, but C is the best one. So, holding your C, we're going to sing Animal Fair, it goes like this, see if you can strum along with me, and I'll put the words down in the description. I went to the animal fair, the birds and the beasts were there. The big bubble by the light of the moon was coming his auburn hair. The monkey fell out of his bunk, 
slid down the elephant's trunk. Woo! The elephant sneezed and fell on his knees. What became of the monkey, 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 monkey? There you go. That is your first song. So it's one, two, three third finger here and I'll tell you in the next lesson why it's important why why shouldn't we use our first finger I know you're all saying I'm going to use my first finger don't do it get in the habit of going one two three because any chord that's in this third box we want to use our third finger usually if there's one in the second fret here we're going to use our second finger and usually here and the reason why we use our third finger there I will reveal to you later but let's play it through again Okay, you ready? Here we go, do your hair. Okay, good. Looking good? Alright, so ready to strum? One, two, three, four. I went to the animal fair. The birds and the beasts were there. The big baboon by the light of the moon was combing his auburn hair. The monkey fell out of his bunk, slid down the elephant's trunk. Woo! The elephant sneezed and fell on his knees. Brilliant. So well done. That is your first lesson done. So I want you to practice that song. I want you to play it to your grown-ups until they're literally crying, till their ears are crying, until they can't take it anymore. Okay. And then come back and we'll learn the next chord, which is going to be F chord. All right. So happy ukuleleing and I'll see you in the next video. Yay!